I'm Dr. Adrienne Mulligan from Camp Verde Veterinary Clinic, and I'm here to talk to you about a rather touchy subject when animals' private organs get into trouble on behalf of expertvillage.com. There are a few fairly common things that happen to dogs back in the rear end of them, and one is for a male dog to extrude his penis. This is a sheath. This is not actually a dog's penis. This is a covering. And a hairy dog, which this dog is not, uh, a hairy dog is at risk of extruding his penis and getting hairs. See, the penis does come out, and then hairs can get wrapped around that penis, not allowing it to go back in. And if it does that, then it will actually cut off the blood supply and the penis will become large and dark and dried out and also uh, very engorged with blood and fluid. And this is something that needs to be corrected pretty quickly or it could require surgery. And one of the things that you have to keep in mind is number one, to clean it, get it moist, get it wet. These are tissues that want to be moist and you don't want to let them get dried out. And you can clean it up like that and get the hairs away from it a bit, but if you still cannot make this engorged penis go back in, one little trick is to dump a lot of sugar on it. Sugar will draw, have a drawing effect and draw the edema, the fluid, the blood, not blood, but the fluid part of the blood out of the penis and help it to shrink so that you can slide it in. Then you might need to use some KY jelly to help it do that and, um, and a lot of water, things to, to help it move back in. The other same applies with a dog that might um, have a prolapsed rectum. A dog that's straining with diarrhea can sometimes prolapse their rectum. A female can also prolapse their vaginal area. And those tissues, again, need to stay moist and saline solution or water, but saline is better. And just your typical saline, like you would use for contact lenses, you can use to moisten those areas and keep them moist until you can get them to the veterinarian. And if they are engorged and very thickened, sugar can go there too. Sugar is, will draw the, the edema from the tissues so that they'll be a little easier to put back into place.